Hello and welcome to Elite Dangerous Odyssey. Yes, uh, the Odyssey dropped yesterday and finally we have a chance to take a look and play it. And today I will be doing a basic transport mission and showing off a couple of game systems in the process. So if you haven't already checked it out or you are in interested how the regular mission looks, take a look and enjoy. I will be sharing a few tips along the way, hopefully for those of you that might have tried a more difficult mission and didn't know what to do. So as you can see, first oh, I'm on a station and I'm gonna go to the Pioneer Supplies because this is where you purchase suits, weapons and whatnots. As you can tell by my balance, you start with 50,000 and of course I tried two missions and failed miserably. So yeah, I know what I'm talking about when I say it comes to failing missions. So. I have a personal experience. Anyway, I figured I want to buy a and you know a medicate or two Anyone and a couple of energy cells. Energy cell capacity is always handy to have, especially when you are when you're out and about and you come to a situation where uh, it's too cold or something like that, so that you can have batteries to you know keep you warm and whatnot. Now, come back anytime. I will. Yeah, so let's go a little bit further out. Now, most of you that have been seen the intro of the game would go to a mission giver. I would suggest those are usually black ops or, you know, shady missions or whatnot. So, oh, look at the hangar. I think once this goes live and there will be ships, this will be amazing. And for the record, yes, they said that this is a live view. So I think Frontier made a quite a nice, you know, little touch here. Almost remind me of the Star Citizen demo that they did a long time ago, you know. However, yeah, uh, let's go to the mission board. And here you can see, you know, yourself, how it looks. God, I'm, so, I'm, I'm hot. Yeah, just kidding. Anyway, uh, so transportation. I'm thinking of transportation mission and let's just take some regular fetch the personal documents from a settlement and whichever doesn't really matter they're pretty much all similar financial boost 83,000 reputation and threat level one. Oh, that's apparently dangerous for whatever reason that might be I don't know but Honestly, since it's a regular collection mission, I don't think that you have to worry about because, you know, no point. Okay, now let's check out the transactions. First, the personal document, and we should be going to the Bray Military Armory in the Aditan system. Okay, well, we are in Aditan system already, so I'm just gonna go to the taxi. Welcome to Apex Interstellar, the first step to everywhere. Wonderful. Local taxi. Alright, I basically skipped this uh, section because <coughs> I recorded a video yesterday while the loading times were still a thing. Frontier has already fixed this in the update and um, so loading times should no longer be a thing. Okay, Bray Military Ar Armory, book a shuttle, 100 kroner, or Jesus, credits. I've been, I'm already thinking kroner. Yeah, what can you do? Anyway, let's go to the Apex Interstellar Transport and go in. There we go. And, you know, that's the favorite and all beloved vacuum cleaner of the Elite Dangerous. So, yeah, I think it's the Adder. I personally had this ship a while, long time ago, and I absolutely loved it. Now, you see, this is the way up, but these are also entries, so that gives me a little bit some hope for future ship interiors, but for the time being you have this magical beam upwards. <coughs> One thing that I have to say, which I think is sheer brilliance, 
is a dash of classical music as you're taking off and landing. I just love it. Let me know in the comments below. Do you think it's kind of cool or what's your opinions on that? I mean, classic music, classical music and space. Just imagine landing on planets with this, some classical music. Blah, gives me the shivers. Now, obviously, you're flying in the adder. Uh, however, you have no control over it. Yeah. So, you have access to all of your regular boards. Oh, friendship drive charging. Yes. Four, three, two, one, engage. Now, uh, actually, the travel over there takes quite a while, so I'm actually gonna skip to the section until we are already in front of the planet, so... Yeah, let's shorten it up. Alright, we're coming in on the planet. It's 2010 light seconds away to the outpost and we're closing in I really didn't want to miss this shot I mean I always loved landing on the planets in Elite Dangerous and I know that I haven't featured that much Elite Dangerous on my channel but I really love it to bits I've done a little bit of space trucking a little bit of hunting and whatnot and honestly I'm an explorer so I cannot wait to see what uh, the Odyssey has, has in store for us. But I'm definitely gonna play a little bit of, you know, PvE, PvP, whatnot. We'll see how it goes. Do let me know if you guys are interested to see that more on my channel, because I cover space games and uh, Elite is obviously a, one of the fa more fantastic space games there are, there is, so yeah. and. I don't know, I just can't speak for the, lack of, for the life of me today. Anyway, dropping in out of the warp to Super Cruise, engaging glide, and as you can see, we can see absolutely Jack. Thirty-two kilometers. I found it a nice touch that the guy says. Oh, music! Oh, and the dawn on horizon. God, this game is beautiful. Here we go. Beautiful. Let's disembark. And we're on to the mission. See? Unsafe temperatures. And this is where your battery kicks in. Now, obviously, I'm trying to figure out where the hell are we, and I'm pressing, I'm trying to find my flashlight, which, yeah, I guess I should have forgot, I shouldn't have forgotten. It's a T, it's a torch. So, yeah. All right, let's try and find the container number 10 of the habitat. Oh, red, that's never good. Hello, Commander Zorin. Also, throughout the base, you have the suit recharge outpost. So you press number three and you click it so that you actually recharge your suit just in case you ever get low on power.
There we go. Let's just try and find anything. Tess Green. She's a scout. And this guy's... Move along. Nothing to see here. All right. Uh, let's see. Oh, command center. Access level one. Okay, we should find somewhere. I guess there should be a place where it's the access level zero. I just need to find it. You? Hold position, Commander. Okay, Tess, what do you have for me? I'm going to scan you. Don't move. Scan. Okay, scan me. You're good. Move along. See? Move along. Nothing to see here. Oh, that's the... S I guess that's the restricted area. Probably shouldn't be here. Commando, come on, give me something. Technically, I don't want to be taking out my P-shirt. Okay, there's the scanner. Scan mode. Can I scan him? No, Fallon Carson, he's a com... I was scanning you, dummy. Now, I'm trying to find the habitat. Anybody seen the habitat? Oh, that says power. Okay. Let's just quickly maybe try and find a terminal or something. Access panel. Yeah, that's always fun. I don't have the Maverick or Marauder suit. I don't know what it's called. So I can don't have the thing to open up these panels. I think it's called Arc Welder. Oh, Hab! Oh, okay, that's subtle. All right, I guess we found the habitat. Oh, look, a terminal. We have a charge port. We can charge ourselves a little bit. All right, now... I'm odd. Have you looked at the mirror recently? Weirdo. Oh, suit recharge socket. Right. Okay, so the icon that says stands for terminal. Good to know. Let's see, what do we what are we looking for? Okay, now you're just we need to find container ten in the habitat facility. Okay, so we have habitat power command center. Okay, aha, so uh, we have rooms, foyer, washroom, recreation room, dorm, med bay. Okay, got it. So I just need to find container 10 in there. Contender 9. And the rest are lockers in the dorm. Okay. Container 11, recreation, atmosphere. Uh, is it just me or I don't see the container 10? Okay. If somebody saw the container 10, then please let me know in the comments below because I'm obviously blind. I'm going to probably skip it until to the point where I actually make a decision. Well, I figured <clears throat> if I cannot find container 10, I'll just take container 11 or container 9 and take it from there. So. Container 11 or container 9? Yeah, let's just go with container 9. Just checking for one final lookup. No, okay. Dorm. Container 11 it is. Good. I feel good about this. <clears throat> now. Let's go. How do I exit? Um, escape, I guess. Alright, so let's get to the entrance. As soon as I'm able to find it. Container 2, 
it's locked. I'm going. I'm thinking if I go in circles around the building, I should be able to find the front door, right? I hope my logic is not completely off. And usually it's on the side where people go in and out. Like here. Ah, level zero. We're in. Alright. Entering pressure. Oh, don't shoot me. I'm just a messenger. Need to stand so close. <sighs> Admins. I mean, come on. All right, some people are outside. I'm just trying to figure out where I can find the container. Now I know how the containers look, but those are ammo boxes. Okie doke, let's check it out. What about you, Dorm? Let's go here. There are no containers here. Hmm. Weird. Okay, let's go on to the other side. I'll probably understand. Oh, there's a container. Keypad unlocked. Well, it's unlocked and there's nothing there. But it is a container. So we're looking for a, one exactly like that. Nothing here. What about in the other section of the dorm? What about over here? Somebody was there, okay. Oh, container, oh no, that's container 11. Grenade case, oh, I'd like five, please. Hmm, but no sign of container 10. I mean, you gotta hand it to them. This game really doesn't hold your hand. What? But I don't know, I kind of like it that way, so... Oh, that's container 10, that's ours. So, let's say 4, 0, 5, 3, and enter. There we go, personal documents. Awesome. Okay, next objective, leave the area. So, like I said, I don't have the risk of getting caught because this is a legitimate fetch mission and I'm just the messenger. So. Hey, watch it. Yeah, I'm watching. Let's just call ourselves a taxi. Apex shuttle, local booking. And I'd like to go back to... Hopkins City, yes. Shuttle request sent. Wonderful. Now all I need to wait is to see where the shuttle will be coming. Leaving pressurized environment. You don't say. I assume you're here for something. Stop, Commander. You are subject to scans like everyone else. I am. Oh gosh. You're good. Move along. Sorry. Yourself, citizen. I'm watching myself. I'm not seeing, I'm liking what I see. Mind yourself, citizen. Okay, I mean, yeah, I'm very mindful of myself. Thank you. I still haven't seen the shuttle come in. Sentry skimmer. Well, oh, there's the ship. 167 meters. Departing in two minutes. What's the rush? All right, it's somewhere over there. Let's get it over there quickly. I mean, it leaves in two minutes. That's very nice. And I'm just like running like as fast as I can. Hello, Quinn Lawson. Yes, I'm getting in the vacuum cleaner. Thank you very much. And board it. Apex. 
All right, I think I'm gonna once again skip until we get close to the station because the travel times in this initial beta were extensive, so... And we're talking extensive couple of minutes, so the same way, uh, same amount it would take you to go with your own craft. But with your own craft you have control, with this you don't, so... Okay, we are closing in on and we're a couple of seconds away from Hopkins, light seconds away from Hopkins City, which is the station orbiting this little planet. So the AI is just right and it's figured, okay, yeah, sure, I should probably avoid that planet. Yeah, makes sense. And there we go, Hopkins City. 10 million meter. Okay, and we dropped out of the frameship drive and we're going towards the Hopkins city. I think it looks like, what is it, Ocellus starport? Or... I think it looks like Ocellus. Nice chatter. Just coming into land now. Yeah. Okie doke. Are you, you know, lined up with a mail slot? Okay, it's coming in. Okay, there was another you know, vacuum cleaner coming out, so we had to probably move. Now let's see how will the AI drive us in. And I guess our pet is 31, which is right down there. Oh, he's fast at landing, I'll give him that much. Thank you so much. Now we will disembark. Thank you for choosing Apex Interstellar. Yes. Have a nice day. Oh yeah, I cannot leave until we get really into hangar. Hopkins City. Thank you. I'll just put it in reverse and coast. There we go. So. Now, the only thing that remains is to go back to the station and return the mission to the mission terminal and then we should be good. Alright, let's check it out. Okay. Looks like mission terminals here. Let's turn the mission in and get some cash. So what do you have for me? I mean, seriously? Yeah, mission board. I want the completed missions, see? I have the yes, complete missions. We can complete it. And what would we like? Reputation, plating, or reward? I'll take the cash, please. Promotion to mostly penniless. <laughs> that fills me all warm inside. All right. Tell you what, guys. I hope you liked this mission. Uh, leave a like, 
leave a comment in the comments below. I'm really curious to hear your opinions if you would like to see more Overly Dangerous. And yes, I've been Groundworks. Once again, thank you very much for watching. Like if you like the video and I shall be seeing you somewhere in the Ver universe. This is Groundworks signing off.